What is up, everybody? It's your boy the Alaman back in the building. But um, we out here watching um this Florida LSU game in the SEC tournament quarterfinals. Uh, right now, <laughs> Florida's upset in the one seed in the tournament by two with 24 seconds left. I love oh March Madness, baby March Madness. Freaking love it. This is wild right now. Up three. This, this is wild right now, bruh. Oh! Jump ball. Woo, got lucky. You got super lucky, bruh. Watching the game right now on the phone, so I feel like I didn't have time to set it up on the laptop. <laughs> wow, right now, bro. That's crazy. I would have picked it up by the oh man, <laughs> they got lucky they even kept the ball. I love Tremont Waters, but wow, what a mistake at a critical time. I'm fortunate to have the possession arrow pointing their direction. Wow, bro. February 20th, they met the first time they went to overtime. Gators won it. 82 yeah. 77. Second time, overtime. After Hudson went for 30 plus, Waters drove all the way to the rack and laid it up through a bunch of hands. I love this time of year, bro. March Madness. I, mean, I know I say it a lot, LSU but March Madness, baby. When Kevon Allen had the ball in his hands and the clock expired. But we set for another one. We got a three point game, 22 seconds to go. And LSU's ball. I mean, it's LSU's ball, but the magnitude of it is you LSU's ball. So the next dead ball, if there is one, is not going to go back to Florida's favor. And the next dead ball, or, or tie ball, should still be with LSU. You've wasted your possession arrow off a mistake. Does it cost him? This game is crazy oh, right now, bro. You're going quick too. I go quick too with Tremont Waters. And with, and Look, they're already wasting time. Well, well, no, he's going to sprint out ball screen, extend the game. Nas Reed's going to... Oh, the three. Are we gonna go in overtime? Are we gonna go in overtime? That's crazy, B. Look at that. Bang, the second three, and that other one tied it too. Florida got one more timeout too. It's not right now. I love it. I love it. Come on, he's getting on right now. You'll see Nas Reed foul. The shot was then made. They gave the shot three points. Then there was a technical foul on Tony Benford. They made two free throws. Then on the foul, they made one. So that was a six point possession, which brought the Gators and put it back on top. Now with 13 and a half in a series in which this is game three in the first two. Both went to overtime. We are set for heroics late or another overtime session. The clock goes back to 13.5 when the ball cleared the net. So this additional two, three tenths of a second could go. come into play here. LSU's going to extend their defense and not let Allen or Nimhard or Hudson. I'm not watching through the other phone. <laughs> yeah, I love technology. Is the guy that's going to get it back. Can he go make the right play? Oh, it's deflected by Waters. Ooh. 
Go three. Woo! <laughs> Ellis. Oh. Oh. Yo. This game is nuts. Rabbi Nimhard initially took the ball out of bounds. And that trail position guy is a dangerous guy because once he got it back and gave it up, the defense kind of lost track of yeah, I swear, like if he makes a, a three at the buzzer to try to go in overtime, I'm losing it. When that ball started attacking to the paint, Tremont Waters gets disengaged and up oh, too late. Tremont Waters is only 5'9", and he's trying to recover to a 6'5 shooter. Your guy, Keontae Johnson, gets the paint touch, the release, the rotation, and the result that just might lock up Florida in the NCAA tournament. A terrific play. Damn. Oh, they, Florida's a lock if they beat LSU. The lack of pressure that Florida has felt in this game in late shot clock and now late game clock situation has been outstanding. But it would be even better if Florida actually went to the tournament, but, you know, but I think they're a, they're a lot if they win today. They got 1.2 to get a three-point shot off. You're going to throw it to Nas Reed, and he has the ability to go up and get it and, and throw it to a side shooter in Mays or, or a Smart on the far side, the Drew play. And of course, Nas Reed is. That was you got no time, I'll tease you. Catch and fired himself. There goes the Nas Reed. Kick it out. They try. Oh, foul. And it's over. At least, at least you got upset, B. Thanks to Andrew Nebhart's. At least you just got upset. At least you just got upset. Holy crap. March Madness, baby.